we're told triangle triangle def they just have to write one triangle there so triangle def is the image of triangle abc after the following composed transformation all right graph the pre-image of triangle abc so pause this video and have a go at it before we do this together Okay, so the key here is that they want the pre-image. Some of you might have just said, oh, I just have to perform this transformation, but that's not what they're saying. They're not saying apply this transformation to this triangle. They said we started with some triangle ABC, then we performed this transformation, and then we got triangle DEF. So what we really want to do is go in reverse. So you might just want to think about what's happening here. The original transformation took the negative of the X value, to get our new x value, and then it doubled the y value. So if you wanted to go and unwind this, what you would need to do, if you wanted to go back to the, let me do it this way, if you wanted to go back to the original, you would take your x, and then you would multiply that times negative one, and then you would take your y, and you would multiply that times one half. Or another way to think about it is, if we perform the following transformation, which you could almost use the reverse transformation, where you take the negative of the x and you take half of the y and we perform this on def we should go back to abc and we can verify that once we think we have abc we can we can do the original transformation and see what happens so let's just do that so this f right over here is at the point this is at the point negative 8 comma 8 so if we apply this transformation this negative eight becomes a positive eight, and then this other eight, you take half of that, you get a four. So it becomes positive eight and four. So it goes over there. Let me just write that, that is eight comma four. This point D right over here is at the point five comma six. Well, you take the negative of that five, you get to negative five, and you take half of that six, so negative five comma three. So it takes us right there. So we, that's negative five comma three. And then last but not least, this point right over here, E, is at negative, oh, sorry, it's at positive two and negative four. So you take the opposite of that positive, oh, positive one, let me, well, what am I doing? One comma negative four, don't wanna make a mistake here. So you take the negative of that one, you get to negative one, and the and then you take half of that negative four, you get to negative two, you get right over here. So you go to negative one and then negative two. And so this is what I am saying. I would argue that this is our ABC triangle. And if we want, we can validate that. We can actually apply this original transformation. For example, if I started with negative five comma three, if I took the negative of that x coordinate, it would become positive five, and if I were to double the y coordinate, I'd go to six, and that's exactly what happened. This got mapped to that, and you can verify the other points would map just like we said they would. Now, one thing to take note of is that the angles in this transformation do get distorted, so it does not preserve similarity. Think about why that is.